in this way where Garoppolo really doesn't have to do too much. <clears throat> Sometimes it feels like Garoppolo kind of gets in, gets to a point to where he feels like he has to force some things. It feels like Garoppolo, like if it's third and eight, sometimes it's like, it feels like he has that mentality, like he wants to be like a gunslinger and just no matter what, not die on this uh, situation. And sometimes that's where you see mistakes happen. You see, instead of him throwing the ball away or whatnot, it feels like there's a lot of times where he tries to force the issue, throwing the ball over the middle and whatnot. And uh, with all the weapons we got, you know, I'm looking at it like, hey, man, all you got to do is do the screen to Debo, screen to Christian McCaffrey, hand the ball off to Elijah Mitchell, hand the ball off to Christian McCaffrey. Every once in a while, throw throw a pass over the middle to Kittle. Um, you know, keep uh, continuing to hit up at you. They've been building a pretty, pretty good chemistry. So, you know, the biggest thing for Garoppolo, in my opinion, is just, hey, don't screw it up. Don't feel like you got to be brave heart. Don't feel like you got to be, uh, no, um, you know, Brett Favre and sling it in there. Hey, hey, every once in a while, throw the ball away. Every once in a while, take the sack. Um, you know, as long as we continue to stay healthy, we continue to stay disciplined. Uh, Garoppolo doesn't try to do too much. Man, I, I think we are well on our way to have a breakout monster second half of the season.